Hi, Linda Winter. Hope you've been playing along with me this whole month of December 2016 for my Winter Designs Winter Giveaway. This is the fourth week, my last giveaway this month. I'll be doing a giveaway in January, but then it goes back to one a month versus the one every week. So this week, because New Year's is fast approaching and you may be stressed from the holidays, wanting to relax, we're gonna do the Keep Calm and Carry Yarn. So I wanna show you a few things that I've given in the giveaway this month, so this week, totally different than what I've done before. There's no templates at all. And for you sewers and quilters, you may say, hi, I'd like to learn how to crochet or knit. In the old days, maybe a year or two ago, I said, I wanna learn to crochet and knit. And I thought, yeah, let me buy some stuff and learn to crochet and knit. So I bought DVDs, I bought books, I looked at magazines. And then I realized it's not gonna happen. I don't have time to do my laundry. I don't have time to get anything done. So, and even to get my nails done. So, I have all these things I'm giving away this week. So, keep calm and carry yarn. So we got yarn over here. I've got a bunch of yarns. A lot of these are eyelash yarns. You're not gonna learn on this stuff. This is just too hard. I do know a little bit about what you do and don't do when it comes to crocheting and knitting. So those of you that are already experienced, you could tell me a thing or two. But I do know when you start, you're gonna wanna start with like a simple yarn. But I've given you a lot of eyelash yarns. There's not a whole lot of any of these one particular color, so you can't make a sweater or anything out of it. But these are things that you can use to add with some of the yarn that you already have or some of that stuff that you know if you're like me that you say hey I want to get into it then you've already collected some things so you've got a bunch of fun furs and a few other things I'm giving you a bag the bag is gonna be um, not empty it's empty now it's got stuff in there but it's stuffing so I'll put all this stuff in the bag when I ship it to you so you have a nice little bag so you can carry your stuff with you when you're at the doctor's appointment the dentist appointment or whatever it is I've given you a bunch of magazines these are all knitting magazines that we see over here it's some great projects great ideas beginners more advanced so there are some great projects for those of you that have been knitting before then you might find some things that inspire you and those of you that are new to this then I'm gonna point you over here if you're new to knitting I've got DVDs so there's magazines that are basically online so instead of having a magazine where you're ripping the pages and losing it and all that stuff these are DVDs that are magazines but you've got some instructional DVDs too so the instruction which would uh, hopefully get you started and have um, some great success with that. Of course, we're gonna do some laughing along the way with some of the things that we've done, the one sleeve that's longer, or that's too big. So then we've got some comedy for you right here. And because we're gonna be doing this all throughout the night and all throughout the winter, I always have to include, of course, for you some more candy. So we got a box full of candy here with our little guys and maybe you'll make one of these scarves that are here. Now the reason why I really wanted to learn to crochet, I was gonna learn to crochet more than knit, but it really was uh, these two books. I don't know if y'all have seen these flowers. I thought, man, these would be really simple. I can do a chain stitch and with a chain stitch, I can do a lot of these fabrics. I mean, a lot of these flowers. So these guys here, uh, these guys that are in here, you can see there's some really cute ideas. Some of you will say, oh, I love it. And others will say, who cares? But it's there for you. So you've got all these flowers. This is just all crochet. Then this was what I started to do years ago. I started felting. Felting is when you use hot water and soap and it takes wool or a wool content and it shrinks it down. This starts instead of just wool, it starts with crocheted yarn out of wool. And when you throw it in the washer and dryer or in a sink with hot water, it shrinks up and it basically turns into fabric. So those yarns that you have, when you get them hot, you can see this, it looks more like fabric. And some of you will know felted wool and some of you will kind of think, oh yeah, I get it. This right here, you can see, this looks like it's a solid piece of like a sweater or something. Um, but this has been crocheted to make this. And oh, by the way, if you don't want to learn to crochet, felting out of your old sweaters, those um, ones that are mostly wool content, you can throw it in the hot wa uh, water with um, some soap in your washer and dryer and it will turn into a nice solid material. So this was really got what got me started with the idea of maybe crocheting and knitting. And again, I said, it's not gonna happen. So I'm passing all this stuff on to you. So I've got all of this here for you, what you need to do to enter. Same thing we've done for the last three weeks. 
And again, if you're new to this, I'll have all the directions on the screen, but right now this should be old hat for you. And if you are new, I'm glad you're here. Welcome to be, welcome uh, here and, and follow along. I've got a ton of videos on all kinds of other stuff, mostly sewing and quilting, not so much knitting and crocheting. This is the only thing you'll ever see me do here. But winter designs for sewing and quilting. If you go to Facebook, that's where my contest is gonna be. It's a giveaway. And every week I've been doing the giveaway. This is the fourth giveaway. You're gonna see a giveaway for the first week, a giveaway for the second week, same thing for the third, same thing for the fourth. You need to enter each giveaway. Again, old hat for those of you that have been around. The giveaway picture, it's giveaway, it's aqua, and it's purple, and it's white. Look for that giveaway, read the instructions that are there. You have two things you have to do. One, if you've been participating all along, then you've already done this. You've liked my winter designs for sewing and quilting page. Not the post, not the comment. You can like that too, but that doesn't enter you into my giveaway. Like my winter designs for sewing and quilting. The whole reason I'm doing this is bribery. I wanna get my likes up. Right now I'm at a thousand something. I wanna be at 5,000. When I get to 2,000, I'm gonna do a big giveaway. I did a big giveaway when I hit 1,000. If you're not sure what I did, if you weren't around then, go look at the giveaway. I give away a mat, a rotary cutter, blades, a ruler, my microwave ball cozy, some batting, some thread. It was a really nice deal. Um, probably $350 worth of product. So I'm gonna do the same thing when I get to 2,000. So go like me, go tell your family and friends to go like me, that'll get us closer to the 2,000 drawing. So winter designs for sewing and quilting, like me. Like that, once you've done the like, then you're good to go. You don't ever need to do that again. And then under the giveaway post, this one for the keep calm and carry yarn, Add a comment, pick me, I wanna win. I don't crochet, I'd like to learn. I don't wanna learn, but I'll give it to my niece who is learning, whatever it is. Add a comment, all you have to do is say hi, even. That enters you into the giveaway. And then what I'll do on the last date of the giveaway, you'll see the dates posted in the Facebook comment, and it'll be posted on this video too. On that last day, I'll do a drawing, I'll draw one name out of all the people that have added the comment. I'll check to see if you have liked my winter designs for sewing and quilting, and then I'll post the next day saying, you're the winner, congratulations. And then I'll get all this stuff shipped out. I'm not shipping this two day overnight because this stuff is gonna weigh a ton and it would cost me a fortune to ship. So I'm gonna do ground, it'll take a little bit longer to get there. But you got all winter to cozy up with the yarn and to plug the DVDs in and learn. So you're gonna take your time and hopefully you're gonna have lots of fun stitching it up and keeping calm, carrying yarn. Thanks for watching, thanks for, for participating, and I hope you had a great time with this, and I hope you'll win. Take care.